In this tutorial, we're going to be automating parameters with our synths and effects. There's essentially two ways to do this. One, by recording it in, and the second, by creating an automation clip and drawing it in. Let's start with recording. What I want to do is I want to create some dubstep style rolls with my echo machine here. Notice that both the Thor and the Kong each have their track in the sequencer, but the Echo doesn't, so we have to create one. Just right click and select Create Track for the Echo 1. Okay, now you can see that it created an automation clip down here in the sequencer. And now I can go in and adjust the rolls that I did by moving the breakpoints around. If I take my pencil tool, I can draw in more points. If I take my select tool, I can select a bunch of points and move them around. I can use Shift to move a selection of breakpoints. and I can use Option to copy a selection of breakpoints. Now that's automation by recording it in, now let's try drawing some in with the pencil tool. I have a wobble base here that I made with Thor. The wobble is controlled by the LFO2. We can hear how it changes depending on how the rate is set. I'm going to select the rate parameter. I'm going to choose edit automation. And that creates a note lane beside the Thor. Now before we can start drawing in automation, I've got to create a clip to go on the note lane. So I'm just going to grab my draw tool, double click, and now I can start creating points. Notice how even though I drew in a ton of points just there, it smoothed it out to a reasonable number. That makes it a lot easier to work with. At this point, it's just a matter of moving the data points around till I'm satisfied with the result. 